I'm dressed like this because Laurel is renewing her vows. It's all a bit tense because we don't know where Ashley is. He's supposed to be here and I'm waiting and he's just not turned up so we don't know whether he's going to do it or not. I think Ashley's actually torn apart, right apart by this and he doesn't know what to feel. Can't even look me in the eye, can you? Bitter? He's, he's hoping he's doing the right thing. He's tempted to exact a great act of vengeance, really, on Laurel by just not turning up at all. Or does he go through with it in the hope of the best? Uh, so he's very, very conflicted by the whole thing. You want a fresh start? I do. Then this is the only one? It's all a bit of a mess because he knows about Marlon. Um, Marlon still loves me, I still love Marlon. Well, I've got kids and I'm married and I've got guilt and uh, it's a nightmare. Marlon obviously has been having this cerebral affair with Laurel and that's now reached fever pitch. And meanwhile you have Marlon, Paddy and Rona involved in another sort of exciting tussle where they're trying to stop Marlon from getting to church and wrecking the ceremony. At this stage in the story, Marlon's absolutely in pieces because he thinks he's missed his chance of, of, of his final chance of, of winning Laurel's heart. I should have fought for her. I should have made a scene, something, anything, but I didn't. I just, I just gave up. I stood there and I let her go back to him. She had a choice. He's let it all go on for too long. He should have stepped in and manned up earlier, and he just didn't do it because he doesn't have manning up in him. The story's run for about six months, and it's getting more and more tense and. And now it's getting to Christmas, and it's a family time, and in a way, it's sort of like, it's worse because she's so not happy, and she's in this kind of family setup, and she has to put on this show that, that this is what she's decided, she's going to stay with Ashley, and it's all going to be okay, but of course, it's just not. The audience now know that, uh, you know, uh, that Ashley's found out. You might think that the story's just finished there, but of course it hasn't. It carries on and something else happens, which is going to be... That's Nicola Wheeler. He plays Nicola. Being silly. <laughs> and they're ready for me on set. Basically, something else happens, which is really awful and it's, it's terrible and it changes the whole thing. Turns the whole situation and the whole story upside down. I've got to go!